News Army. Kosovo requests NATO assistance following weekend bloodshed amid escalating ethnic tensions. After minority Serb demonstrators stopped highways and unidentified gunmen fired on police over the weekend amid escalating racial tensions in the rest of north of the nation, Kosovo's prime minister pleaded with NATO peacekeeping soldiers to help. The Kosovo Force, K4, an international peacekeeping force commanded by NATO, was urged to provide freedom of movement by Prime Minister Alban Kurdi during a press conference held in Pristina on Sunday. He accused criminal gangs of obstructing roadways. Since Kosovo's 2008 declaration of independence from Serbia, which followed the 1998-1999 conflict in which NATO intervened to defend Kosovo's Albanian majority, a precarious peace has been maintained in the region. Serbia rejects the independence of Kosovo. Minority Serbs in northern Kosovo have recently reacted violently to actions they see as anti-Serb by Pristina. After a former Serb policeman was taken into custody on Saturday, Serb demonstrators shut off major thoroughfares. Later, Kosovo police said in a press release they came under small arms fire at several sites and retaliated in self-defense. Meanwhile, a vehicle belonging to Ulex, the European Union mission in Kosovo, was struck by a stun grenade. There weren't any accidents.